Thank you, Gary, and good evening, everybody from Munich at the end of a long and very hot day. Well, who's going to the final of Euro 2024? Will it be Spain, three-time champions of Europe, or France, who have won this tournament twice? seeing it today he's out there for business and the first semi-final of Euro 2024 is underway with France all in white cushioned by Lamine Yamal here is Yamal he saw a little gap that'll be collected Mbappe pulling it into space, but Minyamal will keep that alive for Spain and put a lovely ball back in, which is put over the top of the crossbar. It's a brilliant ball in, and Fabian Ruiz will think he should have done better with that. Oh, no, he definitely should have. He really should. We've seen this on numerous occasions already in the tournament. Here's Mbappe. And now... Colomuani through ball to Mbappe and Jesus Navas was there. Well, there you go. If there's any question marks over Navas in this position and Mbappe. Nicely swept away by Dembele. Mbappe's curling ball and France are in front with Colomuani's header. Luis de la Fuente shakes his head. The French fans shake the stadium. They're in front. Oh, there's an inquisition going on between the Spanish there. The two centre arms, well, Marie's anyway in particular, but this is all about a bit of brilliant play from Mbappe. You see that movement, look how deep he's taking Navas with that run. That's the fear of him running in behind. Here goes Lamine Yamal. Lamine Yamal. Danny Olmo, lovely little dummy. Saliba was just behind in the back heel. There was a slip by Navas. Rabio. Card's going to come out here. Jesus Navas is in the book. But actually, that's not a bad outcome for Spain because they were in real trouble. Freedom and a look about Mbappe as he approaches this, directs it straight into the wall. Jesus Navas, isn't it? Approaching 30. Fabian Ruiz trying to get back to help out Mbappe, cutting inside both of them, got the shot away, it deflected off Nacho, it's kept in play, and Nacho's there to clear. Olmo. Lamine Yamal. Nice curl, oh I say what an unbelievable goal! The 16-year-old Lamine Yamal! That is absolutely astonishing! He becomes the youngest player ever to score in a European Championship. The exuberance, the confidence, the ability wrapped up in one 16-year-old who is very, very special. That special is an understatement. This kid... He's already world-class. This is unreal. It really is. He had a look out to the left towards Williams. They gave him more space. He had another look inside. They gave him more time. Once he gets it onto his left foot for the... Here he is. And here's Jesus Navas. And that's a corner. Great ball in. Well defended. Danny Olmo. Brilliant feet. It's 2-1. It's gone in off Koundé, it might have been going in anyway, but Spain are in front. What a semi-final we have here in Munich. 
We are seeing some stuff tonight. The defence which could not be breached has perforated twice in four minutes. This is what they've been brilliant at all night, Spain. Just playing between the lines, Olmo picking up little bits and pieces. But get on this touch in a minute. When it comes out, Jim, that just there. And then back inside, past Trumeni like he's not even there. That's going into the bottom corner. There's nothing that Jules Kunde can do about that. But the first touch and the second touch. Dembele to the byline, fizzing it in. Kylian Mbappe. Kylian Mbappe. Oh, did well, Nacho. Did. Nico Williams, fantastic. And still going. And the little back heel digs it out to Morata, who can't riddle through three. That's a late one on Lamine Yamal. Teo Hernandez. Lamine Yamal, overlap from Jesus Navas. Yamal comes inside. Ruiz, big deflection. Menyam was rooted, but... Rabio, Mbappe. Mbappe. Yamal's getting forward. Four back for France, three up for Spain. Lamine Yamal. Deflection corner. Overlapping. And Morata was just beaten to it by Saliba. I mean, you, say it, you say it looks so easy, Steve. Beautifully into Fabian Ruiz, bent around Jules Koundé. Menyan has come, and Nico Williams nearly, nearly took it away from him. Lucky. That is outstanding goalkeeping. I mean, he committed. Dembele's corner kick, and the header. Chiumeni's header. Didn't catch it properly, I don't think, because he's there. And Mbappe. Dembele. Brought that down beautifully, actually. Dembele's ball in. Lamine Yamal. It was the same again then. There's only really like Mouani and Mbappe that are actually in goal scoring position. Speaking of which, here's Mbappe. Mbappe, who I see him on there at his near post. Williams. Oh, oh he's just not Makunde recovered well. Kante here for France, Dembele, Mbappe steaming in the middle, Unai Sima got something on it. Rodri kept it away from the Spanish goal, for now, France corner. And the downward header from Upa Meccano is off target. It's almost the same as the true many one. Get toward Mbappe, it's done well Mbappe. Teo Hernandez, just too, just too much on it. He keeps making those runs. And then... Mbappe. That's no gap. Dembele at the back post, Cucurella missed it. Spain have given it back dangerously, and here's the chance which is wasted by Teo Hernandez. That's the chance they've been waiting for. Mbappe's his choice. Barcola's gonna... Lamine Yamal was caught. Lamine Yamal cutting inside again, going for goal again. So I'll give you an easier chance in the first one. He does everything right. Leaves an Mbappe. Giroud in the middle. Mbappe. Mbappe. Been waiting pretty much all tournament for that. And he's put it over the bar. There's Barcola to his right, Mbappe to his left. And Laporte right in front of him. And Lamine Yamal's off on his... Antoine Griezmann's won the header. 
wants a corner. Like it's one. a goal kick. It's a free kick to Spain. Look at that bench. Yeah. <laughs> and Spain are into the final of Euro 2024. The best attacking team at the tournament have knocked out the best defensive side of the tournament. And they've done it with a and they've done it with a 16-year-old stealing the show.